we're back at the Canal Lanes in Southampton, Mass. For the singles knockout portion of the WNECA final event here at the Canal Lanes. Richie Myrick is, is taking on Gordon Pomeroy. Richie's from the Canal Lanes right here. A hometown favorite. Gordon's from the Candle Lanes in Pittsfield, Mass. And a little further down left, we have Irby Kafalis. Irby represents the Fairway Sports World in Natick, Mass. And Chucky Noor, who represents the Bogey Lanes in East Brookfield, Mass. As well as the Colonial Lanes in Worcester. If we look down to the right, we have the championship match of the day. Maybe we can get the last couple boxes here. Top seed. Down seven. He's gonna need a. He's got an opening. He's gonna need a mark. Gary filled his spear with three. There you go. There's a break. Come on. One pin to hit. Steven's gonna need to make the high low jack. It's a big ball. Santoro was my partner today. He really got hot on the end. Big 166 game, I think it was. And that's going to do it. I believe Dave Dupree is going to be our bowler of the year this year. Seaman's just going to miss out by a few points. It's a good match. Gary Santora is our final event winner. Nice job, Gary. Congratulations, guys. Great job, Steven. Good job. Great job. We'll have to check out those final points and see what happened. Well, let's go back on to the singles knockout over here. We have our final four bowlers of the day. Our losers will collect $75 each and the winners will move on to a $150 first prize and a $100 second prize. A little refund on their tournament entry fee this year. He's got the lead right now by 10 pins and he's working on his spear. Sneak on over here. After four, and Irby's at 46. Myrick at the half is at 47. Pomeroy 63. So it's a 16 pin difference in that match. The bowlers are going to switch sides. Nice try. Try by the Urbanator. More on the head pen. Oh, Myra could be looking for a big half here. He's been hot. His last two games were 130 and 140 something. Well, we have a one pin difference in the match here between Irby and Chucky. It's 56 for Herb, 55 for Chuck.
big nine pin drop for Rich. A couple of pieces of wood on the plate to contend with. Oh, Chuck will have to reset. Hey, Dave. Did you know no number one seat won the whole year? Really? Oh, for, for six on the whole year. No kidding. Yeah. Right. Yeah, I know. I lost uh, last uh, month to you. Yeah, right, right. I lost the first yet. I think you edged them out for bowl of the year. Did I? I think so. I, I'm going to double check that. Good job, Dave. I think you needed the win, right? Yeah, I think you needed the win, too. I think you got them by a couple of points. Actually, those uh, that 50 points you told me about. Well, I got points today, too. Yeah, right, 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 right. Yeah, it was, it was less than 100 points, anyways. Good year, you guys both hold great all year. We're gonna give out the awards and the money to everybody. Yeah, 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 it'll be done in a couple of times. We'll get that other stuff started. Yeah, yeah, it is. Gary come out of nowhere today, too. Yeah, because you yeah. All right, Chucky Norris coming back into this match. He's down by five, and he just posted another spear in the eighth frame. Oh, Myrick with a football. Paul Malloy's at 91 through eight. And Myrick's at 77. It's a 14 pin difference. Richie's gonna have to get a couple of marks on the end. Kirby with a double half whister. Went back in the hole for a four box. He's at 91. Nor filling that spear with a, a tough five. Head pin hit. Up the back row for five. But he's up by six pins in the final two boxes. Myrick needs it. A little high, the wood went around it. Oh, Myrick's going to have to double. Myrick will have to double. A good ball. Good ball for John. Didn't carry the seven pin. Nice ten for Chucky. Well, we'll see if Richie can throw a strike here. He had a four bagger, I think, last year in one of the events here at the Canal Lane. He buried it. The big nine. Not, not going to be enough. So Pomeroy will move on to the finals. In our final box here, we have a seven pin difference. Kirby Kapalis at 100, Chucky at 107. Kirby's going to need a mark. On the head pin, almost to the strike. Nor trying to get his spear, he's going to slide by the object. Up and down with his ball. Got to pick it. He's all over it. Nice clutch there. Nice pressure shot. Noah's going to leave those. Those could be two big pins. He's at 115. A five to tie and a six to win. If we have a tie, we'll move into a one box roll off. We'll bowl in 11th frame. He's on the head pin. And he's got the six for the win. Takes it out by one pin. All right, we're going to go to break and come back with our final match of the day. So don't go away. <laughs>